Welcome back, everyone. Holiday season, always a busy time at the Huntington Museum of Art. And we're excited to have with us Shannon Cook and Rain Clover from the museum to tell us about everything that's happening. I feel like there's not a busy time for you, all right? There's always something on the calendar at the Huntington yes. Museum of Art. But Absolutely. what are some of the events that you have coming up? So we have three events coming up in quick succession. Okay. Starting this Sunday with Museum Store Sunday, um, which is our shopping um, part of the Christmas holiday experience. We're going to have 14 vendors set up all right. in the Great Hall so you can shop local. And then we're going to have great discounts in our museum store um, where you can buy lots of unique, one-of-a-kind gifts, gifts from around the world and gifts from around the corner. Um, um, we're going to be open extended hours for that, so 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. on okay. Sunday, and we're going to have free admission for everyone. So even if you don't want to shop, you can just come up and enjoy the museum. Oh, that's great. So Museum Store Sunday. That's this Sunday. That is this Sunday. What were the hours again? 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. Okay. Now, you have something, the Holiday Open House? Holiday Open House is the following Sunday. Okay. Yeah, and Holiday Open House will be Sunday, December 3rd from 1 to 4. We're really excited. We have a lot of holiday activities. Um, the Holiday Open House is where we're going to have the craft here. So the uh, sock snowmen and the ornament Let wreaths will be there. Uh -huh. um, super fun. We have some local performances from the Cabell Midland Collegium Musicum at 1.30 in our auditorium. Okay. Followed by the Wayne Elementary um, Honor Choir and Percussion Ensemble. They'll be at 2.30. There's a lot of... Um, the conservatory is going to have some botanical holiday displays in there. Um, we're going to have Santa, so come get a Santa visit in at the museum. Yes. Um, the crafts, just a lot of fun holiday festivities that day. And is, the, is, is this just a thing where families just show yes. up? Yes. Mm -hmm. How does that Indeed. all work? Yeah, the, it's free that day, that, free that Sunday. Day? Okay. Mm -hmm. We are asking for non-perishable um, donations for the Facing Hunger Food Bank, as well as warm clothes for the Cridlin Cridlin Food and Clothing Pantry. Wonderful. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's kind of like the, we say the price of admission, but it's going to families that may be uh, a little bit more in need this time of year, which uh, is great that you all are giving back. Right. I'm loving, I'm loving the crafts, right. though. I think so that is fun. super fun. So cute. And it's something for the kids to be able to take home. Exactly. Um, Part of your Christmas decorations forever right yeah, yeah. In, in a fun little memory right that that everybody can talk about for years to come be like oh remember when we went to the museum and, and we made those um, I, I, I love this all of the events that you have going on too because mm -hmm. we've talked about this before shopping local you find all these unique little things that you yes. might be able to buy for people that you're not going to get anywhere else. exactly yeah exactly and supporting local folks is always exactly. a wonderful thing keeping that money right here in our communities which is uh, awesome okay another event you all are doing and I I love the name of this one, Art on a Limb. Yeah, so mm -hmm. in between Museum Store Sunday and Holiday Open House, that Tuesday, um, December 28th, from 6 to 8, uh -huh. we are having Art on a Limb. So that is where we have local artist groups come in and decorate trees with the crafts that they make. Um, so Yeah, there's the um, West Virginia Beads Society, the Tri-Area Needle Arts, um, Huntington Calligraphers Guild, as well as the Western Weavers Guild with the West Virginia Basket Makers Association. So they're all going to be in. They decorate the trees um, they come in they do that and then at 6 p.m. when the event starts they're actually going to be set up at tables to kind of talk about their organization talk about the art and work that they do um, so you actually get a chance to kind of interact with them and then a guided tour of these trees starts at uh, 7. Wow lots of great events coming up and I know uh, three kind of back-to-back -back oh, that yeah. are falling around <laughs> each other yes. where can families go where I guess where's the best place for them to be able to find the dates again times sure. and all the information on the holiday happenings yeah. you can go to our website hmoa.org you can also visit our Facebook page or our Instagram page for details but the website is the primary place to go fantastic well Rain, Shannon, thank you all so much. Good to see you as always. Such fun events that the Huntington Museum of Art is putting on for the holidays. And um, just make sure you check out that full list too to get times again. And there, you know, I just make just make a stop at all three because yes. they're all unique <laughs> events and they're all going to be super fun for the family. Thank you yeah. all so much. Thank Good you. To see you. Appreciate yeah. it.